Yeah, Milwaukee police doing a fantastic job tonight, obviously allowing people to protest, but keeping it safe. Now, of course, Red Arrow Park behind me has been ground zero, if you will, for so many of these demonstrations over the last few years. Tonight, people fill blocks, marching all across downtown, doing so several times, even right now, blasting the election of Donald Trump. A huge crowd took to downtown Milwaukee tonight, expressing outrage over the presidential election of Donald Trump. The American Civil Liberties Union says at one point more than 3,000 people took part. I don't believe the president of the United States should be such a, an ignorant and hateful man. Mothers and fathers took their young children to demonstrations to see peaceful protests in action. I want to show my boys that this is a big event. It is a history made. And I want my boys to see what's going on. As they walked west on Wisconsin and across downtown, they hoped the image of people from different faiths, backgrounds, and generations would send a message of solidarity. We might not change anything to the outcome of the election, but I just want her to know that this is not normal. And obviously many of them are still out here near Red Arrow Park. I'm told from many of the groups that have been organizing, more are to come in the coming days. We're live at Red Arrow Park. Christina Palladino, WISN 12 News.